My name is Arnica and in this video I'm going to introduce you to our newest app. The Y Class Android app is here and it will expand your business. Now, there are some options that I'm going to represent to you. First of all, there is the upload ads by the camera. You will get rid of your desktop and allow users to upload the images taken with their smartphone. They just snap and upload. There is the geolocation. It will allow your users to filter ads based on their current location. Your neighbor could be your new buyer. There is the offline use option, so your users will always have access to search results even if there isn't a stable internet connection. Now, the notification system will notify your users once a buyer has been found. It's really quick and easy. You just place the ad, get notified and complete the transaction. That's all you have to do. Another perk is that it's really easy to translate. The app is easily translatable to give your users the best experience possible. And of course, there is a lot more. For example, there are the favorite that section over here. So as you can see, this jacket is in my favorite ads section. You can easily add ads to it. Then, of course, there is the contact ads, post ad, update advertisement, new user, login, and also contact user. All right, so as you can see, this is the home page. From the menu above, you can add different ads if you click on the plus. Here, you can add a new ad. So you have the title, description, select category, price and address. Okay, I'm gonna add a brief description that it's a test ad. Now when it comes to category, as you can see, we have five different main categories. All of them have subcategories, so I'm going to show you briefly. For example, the bicycles have complete bicycles, frames and also parts. There are different subcategories to books, cars, clothes and furniture. So, as you can see, for example, the furniture has chairs, sofas and tables as subcategories. Okay, so let's go back and our ad will go to clothes. For example, you can add a price now or later. You can add an address or a phone number. Bear in mind that if you add a phone number, the potential buyer can contact you on your phone. So those are the two options or via message on the app. So if I add a new ad, as you can see, the advertisement is posted, but first you need to activate. So right now I'm going to get an email in the next couple of seconds and by confirming uh, that email I will be able to post my ad. So every user has to confirm uh, their ad via email, otherwise the ad will not be published. So as you can see, as you scroll down, this is how the main page looks like. We can choose let's say the MacBook Pro. Now, this is how an ad looks like on our app. You can upload pictures. As I already said, you can even use the option upload ads by the camera, which means that you just need to take a picture. Down below, as you can see, there is the option to contact the user or to call them. Those are the two options. For example, I'm going to contact this user and I'm going to send them a message. Hello there. Also, you can add a price if you'd like and you just click on send. Your message has been sent. Or the other option is to call the user, which automatically uh, takes you to the contact form. Or the other option is to call the user. Next is search. So you have the search option. Here you can search by selecting a category. I will select books and travel. And you have the geolocation as you can select location. So by searching for that, I will get all of the results. 
Okay, so next is the About page. From over here, if you press Visit page, you will get to our website. And there you can read more about the app itself, if you want to read some additional information. So, as I mentioned, here you have the favorite ads. So, in order to put an ad in that category, for example, over here, on the top, as you can see, this little star, you have to click on it, and that's all you have to do now. This ad is in my favorites. Uh, the other one is share. You can share your ad with different uh, platforms, as you can see. When I pressed it, I can share my ad. Okay, so let's go back. And if I click on favorite ads, the laptop ad is over there. Now, over here are the messages. As you can see, they're pretty cool. And from over here, you can see your messages. It's actually really easy and convenient. Okay. So let's go back and the last one is my profile. So by clicking on it over here, you can see the different ads I've already posted. Now from up here, you can edit your profile. So I can edit my profile, my name and my email address. From the next one, this is uh, another way to, to add another advertisement. It's a shortcut, so it's the same. You can do it from here as well. There is the search option next. And lastly, you can log out. From over here, you can sign out, log out. And if you do that, as you can see, the website looks exactly the same way. Over here, the last one is again about, as we already discussed it. And if you want to sign in, as you can see, if you have already registered, you just click OK and you fill your data or you register from over here it's really user friendly you just need your email password and to retype the password then after agreeing with the terms and conditions and also the privacy statement you register and you will get an email when you confirm the email that's all you have to do you are logged in all right thank you for watching the video and i hope it was helpful also lastly you can get the app from google store at this point